Uh, hi. This is the process for for your pet larvae beetle. It's the same to all kind of beetle larvae. You just need need uh, some beetle soil in a container, some oxygen, so the larvae will eat the soil until it's fully into a pupa. And once it's a pupa, you every month you will need a bigger container so it can properly pupate. pupate. So right now I'm. I already have my larvae at stage 2, now it's going to be stage 3, so I need to so I need to prepare a bigger container. Wait, no, I'm using this small container. So first, you put in the fermented soil, and you put some water inside, but make sure it's not too flooded, like this cookie dough form quite hard and you just mix it around you can wear gloves if you think this is gross uh, that's it okay so first before you get your larvae out you want to dig a hole inside the soil that you put in the new big container for the larvae to get in and then if you want to get out the larvae use something to Dig out or pour the dirt on, but if you make sure you don't want to hurt harm your larvae, you can carefully dig out for it. It's going to take quite a while, so I'm just going to use the cross but then just wait and protect it from my hand and hopefully it's in there. Okay, just dig for I see it. It's alive. And it actually burned a hole. Oh, quite feisty. Alright, I see it. Okay, it's coming up. Got it. Carefully, it's quite fragile. It, it doesn't really bite though. So here. No, it was, it's alive, it's just not familiar with the environment. But here's the larva. It's in stage 3. So, you put it in the new container, the hole, and it's gonna dig down. See? It's starting to dig down. So, that's it. My father's gonna help me press the button because my hands are too dirty. So, bye.